as you've probably seen from the photo just before this video started this one started off as uh, just a, a tree stump basically <clears throat> and i've used the chainsaw to cut it down and i've also used the chainsaw to cut into this to make some interesting grooves um i've dried it out uh obviously it's the woods crack like it does so i've just sanded the edges down now this is going to become something completely different it's going to be a light but it's going to have two lights on it and it's also going to have a carving on it so i'll show you what that looks like in the next video cheers Hiya, it's Alan from Recycled Rustic, uh, and today I just wanted to show you uh, my latest creation, what I've made, with the help of uh, somebody else as well, but I'll go into details about that. Now, uh, first of all, this here was a piece of a tree stump, and I've chainsawed it down, same with that part there, made a gap for this light. I've also got an E27 bulb, which is also known as Edison bulb in there, as you can see, all brass fittings, all brand new, top quality. I've got an extension pole on there to give it a bit of height. Um, got these on and off switches here. And then this here is I've mounted this carving on the front. Now, I've not personally made this carving. I won't take, uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? What? Credit, oh, that's the word, yeah. <laughs> Thanks to my wife, the SA. Credit, credit. Yeah, I'll not take the credit for that because I've not done it. Uh, I might have a go, actually, these at some point in the future, but at the moment, I've not done this. But anyway, I thought I saw this online, and it's quite expensive, to be fair. And I bought it and thought it looked fantastic on a lamp, if I can get the lighting right. So what I've done, I've put one of these bulbs in the background to try and create a sort of, you know, an evening moon behind the... Owls, and I think it works all right. Let me know what you think. So, you could have it on like that as sort of just even in the daytime, like it is now. As you can see, it's daytime here. Just have it like that, um, just to show off the owls, really, because I think his work's so brilliant. I think it's worth doing. Uh, and then, when it comes to nighttime, you want to more of a, a substantial lighting. You can put that on, turn that off if you want. And it still looks nice, it still illuminates the uh, owls lovely and obviously gives you room, plenty of light as well. So I hope you like this, if you've got any questions uh, about any of it, etc. Oh, the dimensions first, just to let you know, it's, uh, it's approximately 2 feet high and, and 12 inches wide. So just to give you an idea how big it is, you can see from this, this top here. Alright, thanks a lot, bye bye.